for today for this Friday. Again, a cold start to the day. Bundle up, but then we will slightly try to rebound a bit, not by much, only pushing temperatures into the mid-20s by the day's end before that sun does set at 551. Overnight, we already start to usher in more cloud cover. It will be a slow build on our cloud cover, so that will allow one more bitter cold evening with temperatures dropping back into the teens. Maybe even some of you see the single digits again. Before tomorrow, for your Saturday, we can have some filtered sunshine at the start of the day. We'll continue to increase that cloud cover hour by hour throughout the afternoon and evening, as this all is leading to our next system, giving us some snow overnight Saturday into Sunday. Now this will wait until after sunset. So this is most likely when you're sleeping Saturday evening. This will push in from southwest to northeast. It's all coming from a low pressure system that's moving through Indiana and the Ohio Valley. So we're on the northern edge of this. We're going to continue to stick with this snow throughout much of your Sunday. It's going to take until Sunday evening for this to really break up and push out of here. I think this model breaks it up a little bit too quickly that will hang on a little bit later throughout the afternoon and early evening on Sunday. We may even see a few flurries linger into Monday. So let's take a look at two snowfall total maps here. This one is European model. I think this underdoes it just a little bit. Uh, this is giving us about one to four inches of snowfall. It does have the right idea, though that our higher snowfall totals are down towards our state line. So let's flip the page here. Look at our GFS model. This gives everyone several inches of snowfall. I think two to four in the I-96 area, three to five, maybe with an outlier seeing more as you travel more towards the I-94 corridor. So definitely a good several inches of some wet, heavy snow this time around. So you'll notice the difference in that uh, texture of the snow when you're shoveling it with that wet heaviness uh, for our snow on Sunday. So here's a look at the next couple of days. 28 degrees tomorrow, 28 on Sunday as well. This could see some flurries linger into Monday and then temperatures start to rebound a bit next week with some sunshine on Tuesday and Wednesday. And then our uh, next system comes in on Thursday with a rain snow mix, 35 degrees.